What's up everybody and welcome back. If you're new to the channel, welcome to A Taste of Cafe Nailu, where everything is lip smacking, toe tapping good, and most importantly, everything is simple to make. So today I'm gonna to be making blackened salmon topped with blue cheese crumbles along with blue cheese dressing. And we're gonna eat that over some wild rice and a side of broccoli. Mm, my lips are watering already. Yours should be watering after what I just said. And if you don't like blue cheese, skip it. But I tell you, if you do, you're gonna be missing out. So let's get this ball rolling, y'all. Check out the ingredients I'm gonna be using for this blackened salmon with blue cheese crumbles and blue cheese dressing. Here are all the ingredients that will be used for the spices. And I will list them in the description box below. All right, as you can see, I have my filet here. It's been washed and patted dry. And I did remove the skin from mine. It came off very easily. Uh, if you prefer to have the skin on yours, you can do that. Here's my seasonings. And everything is listed in the description box below. I have uh, smoked black pepper, basil, thyme, onion powder, Italian seasoning, black pepper, onion, I'm sorry, garlic powder, salt, and cayenne pepper. So the um, amounts will be in the description box below. So we're just gonna swirl those around real good. Just sprinkle on the top. And just rub that in. And I want to do the back as well. Well, I guess I am gonna use all of this. All right, so now that we have it all seasoned, might as well go ahead and use it. I'm gonna just cut down the center and make two fillets. And then cut down those halves to make four. And my skillet is getting hot and we're gonna put in three tablespoons of butter. Well, let's see how two work first. Let me just work with the two and see that may be enough. I think two is gonna be enough. Get that all heated up. All right, now I have my trusty tongs and I'm just gonna lay them front side down. And this is on a medium high heat. So we're gonna cook these on each side about three to five minutes, or it depends on how long it takes to, because these are a little thick in the center, so it may take a little longer than five minutes. All right, I'm gonna turn these babies over. Uh -oh. like a medium but I like them well my husband and I so let's get this all plated up with the blue cheese and blue cheese dressing over that wild rice all right everybody we're almost done 
But before I put the uh, blue cheese and the dressing on, I wanted to show you the type of rice I use. It's uh, the rice in the bag, ready rice by uh, Uncle Ben's. They have all different brands uh, and it cooks in 90 seconds. All right, so I'm just gonna sprinkle on some of the blue cheese just on top and you know you're dressing and we're just gonna add some of that. And of course, again, you can do it the way you want, add what you want. And then that's it. All right, now let's give this a try. Get the meat, get the cheese, and a little of the rice. Mmm. This blue cheese takes another level. Gotta try it out. Come on, y'all. Check it out. Let me know how you like it. Okay, now. Don't forget. Like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you'll be notified each time I drop a video. Later, Gators. This is so good. It's like you got a gourmet meal in your own house under 30 minutes. Mm. I'm telling you. It's worth it. Don't forget. Squeeze that lemon over it. Mm. You fix this for your man, your boo, your significant other, whomever. Trust me. They are definitely going to think you did whole lot and you were in the kitchen a long time. Check it out. Hey, I forgot to mention, if you're interested in my stuffed salmon recipe, that was one of my earlier videos that I made when I first started videoing. It is to die for and it is simple to make. So check it out. It's, I made it, mm,